atop the Stelvio. The final stage of the Gyro d'Italia 2025 could end on the Stelvio, half a century after the climactic battle of Italy's Fausto Bertoglio with Spain's Francisco Caldos on the mountain. Talking at a presentation of this year's demanding stage 14 over the Mortarolo and Santa Cristina to Africa, Lombardy Regional Councillor Massimo Sertori mentioned that an official bid had been made for the Stelvio to host the grand finale of the 2025 Gyro. The occasion would serve to mark the bicentenary of the development of the highway over the mountain. Paul Tallina, 85 miles northeast of Milan, will host the 2026 Winter Olympics, Alpine Skiing Women, Freestyle Skiing and Snowboarding. In 2025, we will celebrate the 200th anniversary of the motorway on the Stelvio. I've already met with the governor of the Alto Adige area, Arno, Compatker, we're formally asking, Moro, Vecni for the final stage of the gyro to be on the summit of the Stelvio, Sir Tori mentioned, in response to Logit Cittadillo Sport. The 2025 gyro will precede the Milan Cortina 2026 Winter Olympics, the highlights of which might be right here within the Val Tellina. We are working to target our goals here and also celebrate the Olympics. The 2700 meters high Stelvio has appeared in the gyro on 13 occasions. In 2013, the stage was moved to Val Martello and then cancelled due to heavy snowfall. In 1975, gyro director Vincenzo Torriani made the novel resolution to put the end of the gyro atop the Stelvio and the final stage proved a dramatic one, as Fausto Bertoglio and his closest rival Francisco Galdo stooled all the way up to the summit. Although the Spaniard took the stage victory on the Stelvio, Bertoglio took overall victory in the gyro by 41 seconds. The gyro climbed the Stelvio for the first time in 1953, when Fausto copy dropped Hugo Coblet, who led the race for 12 days, on the penultimate stage in Bormio to claim the pink jersey. The mountain has featured as a summit end on four events, most recently in 2012, when Thomas de Gent went on the penultimate day and moved onto the podium, denying 2011 race winner Michel Scarponi. The Stelvio performed a pivotal function during stage 18 in 2020, when Rahan Dennis created the race-defining transfer over with an assisting eventual gyro winner Tao Gegenhardt and second place Jai Handley on the highway to Lagutti Cancano.